All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. We are in the next match of the winner bracket. We have Nutella Kitty versus Wombo Combo. It could be any more awesome in terms of the names. So we have for Nutella Kitty, we have Taz and Peachman, and on this other side for Wombo Combo, we have Nace and Radian. First place gets taken out right here, and the map is Blood Run right now. I have some mini legs here. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> what a nice round, Wombo Combo, take round number one, very very quick uh, kill there in the end. But yeah, Blood Run, it, it looks exactly, and also the weapons are um, positioned like on the Quake Life map. So that's pretty easy to uh, to realize maybe. I have to check the uh, Twitch chat a little bit more again. And <laughs> now I'm hungry again because of the team names, that's Jacob in the chat, yeah. It's 8 before the stream, so I'm so fine so far. Raiden picks up a frag. And also the ray gun. Nicely done right there. Now he backs up for the for the arrow. Oh, Peachman couldn't avoid one of these rockets. There's also another rail. Nicely done. Test gets taken out and there's the round win number two for Wombo Combo. Oh, and thanks by the way, Alexei, for explaining some uh, things for the uh, newcomers in the Twitch TV chat. Feel free to uh, ask more questions, of course. But yeah, respawn timer indeed increases with every frag by two seconds. Yeah, nice, nicely done here. Picks up the rail. Nice dodging here from Peach. And he makes the frag as well. Wow, that was a good move. Really nice dodging there by him. Now Nace versus Tess. He may just respawn. He gives away two hits. Nicely done. Oh, the, the head arrow was very, very close here from Peach, man. He has to be careful. He gets taken out Nace with a nice frag. Raiden I can't go out now. There's a Nucleus on the right side. Oh, and there's the rail flag as well, just in time. 3 0 4 Wombo Combo here in this best of one. This might be a very quick round, but I hope uh, Nutella Kitty can turn things around in the next few rounds. And there is the first frag already. But Nace with a nice rocket around the corner. Always has to be careful. These red blocks, if they are like vertical, you can shoot against them. That's what Nace did a few times and now they take him out. Nicely done. The nuclear spawning here on top and the ray gun right below. That was that was the perfect prediction nucleus by Nace. He knows where the player jumps up when he's using the jump pad down below. So he just spammed down, picked up the nucleus, spammed it down. No idea what this shot was about. Could it get into the middle here again? I never actually tried that to be honest. I have to ask him later on. And ah, the nuclear was still stuck at the wall behind him. He takes him. He takes him out. 4 0. Nice. Once again, two nice rockets here at the start. Tess has to be careful, but he takes out one player as well. Now it's a 1 1 situation. The one player is respawning behind him. He has to be careful that he doesn't get taken out. Five seconds until the, respawn, uh, the weapon spawn. His teammate drops down, gives, takes the frag, and Nace has to be back off because of the nucleus. He couldn't get any, uh, any closer, but he picks up the arrow instead. It was pretty nice. They have one arrow. For the beginning, but still the better start for Nutella Kitty as they, they have one rail, one nucleus, and one arrow. So that's a pretty decent start. So let's see if they can convert it into a round win. And there's the frag, nicely done. Four, four to one. They're not quite done yet. We 
Leechman now in the infight again. He might be able to sneak it away! Awesome move by him! He used the rocket splash to push the players away. That was pretty nice. Oh, Peach Man, he didn't see him coming, but he avoids all the rockets and also the arrow. Kinda funny. Oh, nice two rockets there by Nace. He only has one armor, has to be careful, otherwise the combo breaker will be there for Nutella Kitty and Nace picks up another armor just to be a little bit more safe. Break takes a frag on the top. So then, very good position for the second item spawn. P they pick up the Raygun and the Nucleus. That was a pretty good start. Oh, Raiden gets the arrow as well. That is so unfortunate for Tess. This might be the round win. Number five that Wombo Combo needs. They had a very good weapon, weapon advantage. But ah, Raiden goes down. Nine seconds reload for Wombo Combo. So they couldn't pick up the kills, but they picked up all the weapons. Oh, almost all the weapons. Oh, nice frag by Nace. And Peachman gets taken out as well. There's the combo breaker though. Oh, almost a plus two hit here by Nace. Takes one damage, picks up the arrow, and also will pick uh, the nucleus and also will pick up the railgun. So once again, such a hard time for nu Nutella Kitty. They don't give, get any weapons. Peachman, last minute. Setting. Oh wait, they got the railgun. And the nucleus as well. Wait. Oh wow, nice frags. Really nice frags. Never mind. Oh, what a nice save by Peachman. He killed the nucleus with the ray gun. He switched over to it just in time. And somehow out made two hits. I have no clue where he, where he did hit them. And there's a 5 to 1. GG, Wombo Combo advance into the next round.